I hit the game winning, you ain't even see it. Welcome to the halftime show. I need a break from the game. God, thank you for the halftime show. Check out the Patreon for exclusive content only you can see, my boy. Check it out. Link below. Oh, man. Don't be scared now. Don't be scared now. The game's here, man. Tomorrow night, it's going down. LSU, Alabama. We're here now. Alabama fans shaking in their boots, ain't they, man? Yes, sir. <laughs> you already know what's going to happen. LSU's defense finna going to step up. Alabama's offense is going to play the exact same way they have all year. Garbage. Trash. Embarrassing. Man, let me tell you how bad this offense is from Alabama. When Jalen Milrose eligibility is over with, right? Uh, he's no longer able to play at the University of Alabama. Where's he going to be? It ain't going to be the NFL. Yeah, I'm just saying. <laughs> it, no, it ain't. It ain't going to be a starting position. I can promise you that. The sad thing is Jalen Milrose actually has some talent. Right, this Alabama offense is just poop, garbage. It's embarrassing to watch. Right, as an Alabama fan, I would be terrified for my life right now, man. LSU's about to put a whooping on you. Just know that. Just know that. Right, you you guys hate losing to LSU so much. Everywhere I go, that's all I hear. No oh, LSU, man. LSU, LSU, man. Keep LSU name out your mouth. Simple. Just like last year. Y'all didn't see what happened last year coming. Y'all ought to see this coming. I, I've warned you all week. Uh, and if you don't, man, you're in for a surprise on Saturday. Yes, you is, man. LSU's going to drag you up and down the field. Uh, Jaden Daniels is going to throw for 300 yards and a couple touchdowns. He's going to win the Heisman because of this game here. Uh, Jaden Daniels is going to play so well in this game against Alabama. He's going to be given the Heisman uh after the game like immediately after the game, he's gonna walk in the locker room and they're just gonna present him with a heisman it's that simple <laughs> and what's this whole thing about can't be saving twice man listen two teams have already done it lsu did it back in what was it 2010 2011 something like that Ole miss did it back in 14 and 15 lsu is gonna do it again come last year and this year 2022 and 2023 will be remembered as the two years that we beat nick saban back to back because Nick Saban, it's, how long is this guy going to continue coaching? It's about time for retirement. That's what it's looking like, man. Nick Saban may not be there much longer. He may not. I don't see it. I don't think he's going to retire after this year. I really don't. But it won't be long. It won't be long. And once Nick Saban's gone, you guys are going to freak out, and you're not going to know what to do. Uh, winning isn't going to be a thing anymore at Alabama. No, it's not. It's not. Not without Nick Saban. Better get used to losing, is all I can say. <laughs> I don't know, man. Can't beat Saban twice. Man, please. We've already done it. Ole Miss did it. We're going to do it again. And then what are you going to say? If we do it again, this that excuse can't be used anymore, right? If we beat you this year, that means we beat you twice in a row, Nick Saban. And that excuse doesn't exist. You can't beat Saban twice. False. Fake news. Where'd you learn that? Huh? We already did it. Yeah, twice. We beat you twice. Twice. <laughs> Loser. Man, please. Greatest coach of all time. Let me tell you something, man. Bama fans that love Nick Saban. Let me tell you something. LSU's going to put a whooping. A smackdown in the making, man. It's going to go down in history. Uh, we beat what? We beat Purdue back in January, like 63-7 to or something like that. Man, you'll be lucky if we don't score 100 on you, man. Let me tell you something. Man, don't get me started. And you know what? The Alabama song y'all play? Dixieland Delight. Play it. When do you play? Do you play it at halftime or after the game? It doesn't matter. I want you to play it after this game. After LSU is stomping a mud hole in you, I want you to play this that song. Because y'all love saying our name in that song. You might as well just play it. Play it. I dare you. I dare you. I want you to play No, 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 no. I want you to play it because it's actually a really good song. But also I want you to play it when LSU's up by two scores. Uh, in the fourth quarter, I want you to go ahead and play that song if you don't mind. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. I play it any other time. Might as well play it now. Might as well play it when LSU's beating you. I mean, come on. Stadium's going to be empty at halftime. Bryant Denny Stadium is going to be empty. LSU's going to run the fans out of there. Uh, I know someone personally that's going to the game as a Bama fan, but uh, she won't be there after halftime. Got to beat the traffic. We're already losing. Got to beat the traffic. Yeah. I don't know, man. Oh, my God, man, man. Hey, you better beat the traffic. 
because someone else is getting beaten. It ain't traffic. It's Alabama. <laughs> uh, anyway, man, I already told you. LSU's beating Bama, and that's just how it is. That's how it's going to be for the foreseeable future. After Nick Saban's gone, it's over for you guys. You may never win another game against us. Seriously. Brian Kelly, one of the greatest coaches of all time. All he's missing is a national championship, man. And he's going to get it. He's going to get it right here. Right here at LSU. Brian Kelly's going to win a natty. Maybe not this year. We do already have two losses. I don't even know if we'll make the playoffs. But, uh, yeah, I mean, you won't either, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, yeah I'm just saying. Um, but LSU's winning this game. That's all, I, that's all I'm going to tell you. You, you, I mean, you, let me tell you, look in my eyes, look in my eyes, LSU is winning this game, that's all I'm saying, man, simple, LSU's winning, um, Alabama stands no chance, but anyway, LSU's winning this game, where's my real glasses at, man, hold on, all right, LSU's winning this game, simple as that, let me put these back up, um, what's that Morgan Wallen song, Tennessee fan? Finna be LSU fan after Saturday night. Jokes on Alabama, cause they lost big this time.